Hey, people. I was just thinking about a lot of people and my clients and a lot of people that are going through a lot of things this morning. And so I just wanted to send a little message to all of them. Uh, everybody that knows me knows that I have gone through hell and back and been blessed to just make it through. And so this morning, I was sitting here in my car praying and I was thinking like, oh my God, I'm so blessed and so grateful to have made it through all that I've gone through and just been blessed that I can't help but to continue to be the person that I am to continue to help people. I've had so many people hurt me, you know, and, and try to destroy the person that God blessed me to be that I said, no, I'm not gonna ever hurt, help anybody else again. But <clears throat> still, I'm like, no. I have to continue to help people because it's just who God made me to be. And so this morning or this afternoon or whatever it is that you watch this video, I pray that you can see a person that has gone through so much. I'm divorced twice and a single mother with nine children and, and still blessed to get up every day with a smile and get up every day and just continue to go on and, and that's not me it's God so I think one of the first ways for someone to heal themselves is to just personally find a relationship with God and just make him your best friend make him your everything make him that person not make him because he already is you know you just have to realize that he is that person that you can go to and that no matter what like we spend so much time trying to be accepted by so many different people I spent all my life trying to be accepted by everybody my family my friends you know the people that surrounded me in the Muslim community of Baltimore like I, I spent so much time trying to be accepted by all of them hoping that at some moment or some time that they would just genuinely accept me and love me for who it is that I am and even though you know a lot of that never happened it doesn't even matter now you know, like I am who I am. And for the first time, you know, at first I was like, Dad, it's sad that it took me all these years to finally be able to get over all the hurt and pain that was caused by those people, you know, and, and to be able to be okay. But it's not sad. It's a blessing. You know, everybody goes through things and, and it takes them a certain amount of time to get through things. And for me, it took a lot. I mean, those people damaged me in ways that, you know, I can't even, not even going to describe. There ain't enough tape. But thankfully, I have family and friends and, well, really family, not friends, but family, you know, that loves me and supports me and accepts me for who it is that I am today. And I can say at 30 years old, I'm blessed and proud to be who it is that God has blessed me to be, not just today, but every day of my life. And, you know, although some days will be good and some days will be bad I'm just grateful and I'm I'm so blessed and as I sat here and prayed I just thought about it like so many people will probably be like one of the reasons I help young girls is because I know exactly how you feel like I know how it feels to be alone depressed confused desiring to have someone love you accept you and be there for you and just understand you you know, and when you don't have that, not even just when you're a little girl, but when you don't have that as a person at all, it's a hurtful thing and it's a hard thing to deal with and accept. But I'm just here to say that, you know, in the end, God accepts you and you have to accept you. And I finally understand that. And now I accept me. I love me and I'm proud of me. I've dedicated the past two weeks to me and I'm just I'm proud of myself for finally doing something for myself. And I feel amazing. So, I just wanted to share that with you, and I was going to sing a little song, but, you know, I'm not Beyonce, and so I was just like, should I, should I not? So, I saw, I sung this in, like, another video, like, a little piece of it, but it's so serious, it's just like, I've had some good days, I've had some hills to climb, I've had some Every day, and some sleepless nights. But when I when I look around, and I think things over, God be telling me that all of my 
good days I'll weigh my my bad days and because of him I I won't complain you see he he knows what's best for me let me tell you something I hope you enjoyed the video because I can't even get through the rest of the song but be blessed and get up